my God! Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's the Everybody procedure, calm. everyone? What's the procedure? Stay calm! Wait, 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 wait. Everybody just calm down! Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on Supergirl Season 5. Get hyped guys, we've got our first trailer, I said it was coming, and it's finally come. It's only 10 seconds long, but you know, it's new footage, a lot to get excited about. Also, they released a slew of new photos, we're going to be breaking it down in today's video. I'm very excited for this one because we've been waiting such a long time since Comic Con, and we finally got new stuff. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Okay, so we have this trailer, it's more of a promo, it's only 10 seconds long. I'm expecting them to release a trailer that is probably about a minute long in the next week or so, because if I do remember back to maybe last year or the year before, they do this thing where they release a short trailer or a short promo, and then they release an extended version which will include the same footage, but will be longer and include other footage as well. So should expect that sometime very soon because we are about a month away until Supergirl returns. And to remember it's on Sunday, it's an hour later, it's at 9, 8 central. If you live in America, that's the timings for you. So a lot to get excited about. So let's get right into this video. Okay, so the first shot of the trailer is of Lena. And Lena says, I need to know why you betrayed me. And so obviously she's talking to Kara in the scene. I believe she's actually in her lab if you look around in the background. And so Lena's just wearing her normal clothes, so she's at work essentially. And this is seemingly very early on. As we got the revelation that Lena now knows Kara is Supergirl towards the end of the last episode of last season. So I'm guessing this is going to be one of their sort of earlier or midway through the episode confrontations between Kara and Lena. So with her saying, I need to know why you betrayed me, essentially she's feeling betrayed because, you know, her best friend essentially has been lying to her for so long. Obviously, if you were like me or someone, you would be like, oh my god, your friend Supergirl, whoopty fucking do, that is amazing. But, obviously, we need to create some drama. So that's what's happening, and I think it's going to be some good drama, and I'm looking forward to it, if I'm personally honest. Then we move on to the next shot. We see this shot, again, that we saw in the Comic-Con trailer. It's a bit extended, but you get to see Kara, and Kara is taking off her glasses. She looks down, and this is obviously when she's in confrontation with Lena, and she is sort of having to face up to the facts of why she had to lie to her best friend as being Supergirl for so long. The fear is oozing off of her face and I think Melissa is doing a really good job here and I'm very excited for this scene. Okay, so let's move on to the next shot and the next shot is of Midnight, the villain of the episode. We previously got some behind the scenes photos of her and now this is our first moving look at her so it's a close up shot. Her hair is floating and in this scene she says there is no hiding, and then she proceeds to somewhat scream, like a canary cry. So we move on to the next shot, we see this shot right here, sort of mid-battle, you know, her hair's flying around, she's in action, and we move on to one of the final shots of the trailer, and she is using that sort of canary cry, it sounds like a canary cry, and it looks like her powers are actually coming from her mouth when she screams, because in the trailer you can hear her screaming. So, I'm not sure how specifically her power's gonna work, they look really cool, and I like the sort of blue waves that come out, and it sort of engulfs Supergirl in the next shot that's on the screen right now, and it's sort of distorting everything, and you can see the power sort of overtaking Kara, and so we'll move on to talk about the photos in just a second, but that sort of gives us an idea of how they're going to defeat Midnight in this episode, this is episode 1 obviously, so she's only going to be the episode 1 villain, but I'm really looking forward to what's happening, and this trailer does make me very, very excited. So then the last thing of the trailer is the new logo, so it's obviously the same text, but everything is purple, and I just thought I would mention it because it looks really cool, and it's obviously 
to match what was going on with Midnight and her powers and the sort of direction they're going this season. It's a bit more darker. Okay, so now let's move on to the new photos that they released in conjunction with this trailer dropping. There is a lot of photos. We went over about five of them the other day that came out and now they've released all the rest. Talking about this first photo right here, this is my favorite photo, my favorite look at the whole season because this really is amazing. You really get to have a full look at Kara's suit and you know her hair is flying back you know you can definitely tell that this is you know midway through a battle maybe she's using her powers maybe midnight is about to use her powers and you can see that face of sort of shock on Melissa's face and I think this is the best photo because it looks really good because of the hair flying back and everything but also because I think the acting is very good from what I can see here and it just makes me very excited. This is probably the photo that makes me the most excited for what's to come. And so you really get a good look at her suit. Like I said with some recent photos, I really love the suit. I think it's so good and I think it's the best upgrade that they could have gone for. And so yeah, let's move on to talk about the next photo. The next photo is just an HD look at a photo that was released the other day. And it contains Supergirl, Guardian... Nia and also Brainy just down below again you can really see the new look of Supergirl and like how everything has changed and it looks really cool you know Melissa's bangs and obviously the new suit okay so let's move on to talk about the next photo we got Brainy and he's holding I think an ornament I don't know if it's some sort of device but it looks more like an ornament in this circumstance so maybe just grab something to attack Midnight, but they are in that same auditorium that theater that we've been seeing in all these photos So yeah, this is a new one very exciting. Let's move on to the next photo We have Kara and Jean this is seemingly a photo that happens just before some of the other ones because we've had these aisle shots with everyone there But now it's just Kara and it seems like she's just landed this looks like she's in that position where she lands and Jean's just behind, so she's very confrontational. Then we move on to the next photo. We have Guardian behind in the same spot. So like I said, I believe that photo before is as she lands, Jean lands as well. And Guardian's here and her hands are clenched. They are about to fight. Okay, so moving on to the next photo. It seems like this photo shows the aftermath of Midnight using her powers. Because Brainy is putting his arms out, it seems like he's a bit off balance and... It seems like he's been knocked back by her powers and we have James here as well. So moving on to the next photo, another new look at Nia in the auditorium. And this photo for some reason has a line across it, I don't know why, you know, some sort of rendering issue. But anyway, so let's move on to the next photo. We have Alex again, we saw a photo of her in this dress the other day. And like I said, and I want to express, I'm so excited this season that we're going to see Alex in you know, different clothing, different situations than just being at the DEO and wearing the suit all the time because it got a little bit boring last season so I'm excited and I love the prospect of her and Kelly getting to do other stuff rather than just be, you know, workers at the DEO. And John's also in this photo, he's in the background, he's got his hand on his head, it seems like he's been hit by midnight somehow and he's a little bit dazzled. So yeah, Alex has got her gun out in this scene so most definitely they're being attacked and it seems like from all different angles there's going to be Supergirl, there's going to be Alex and Sean, then we're going to have Nia and Brainy like in this next photo, all attacking Midnight all at once. So it seems like Nia is going to use her powers here and Brainy has some sort of device and I think this is the device that I mentioned earlier that is somehow going to stop Midnight and contain her powers because from what we saw in the trailer it seems like her powers are you know really hard to contain because they are all over the place and not even Supergirl can best them so I think Brainy is using that to stop her somehow and so from a different angle I think Guardian's going to be here and he's going to try and contribute to defeating Midnight and Jean has some sort of cuffs maybe it's meta cuffs maybe it's you know alien cuffs I don't know some sort of really tough cuffs so she can't break out essentially and then we move on to the next photo, completely different scene, kind of exciting to see some different stuff, but it's Kelly and James 
they are sitting on a sofa and it just seems like a normal scene where they're going to be talking, some sort of meeting, it's kind of formal. James is dressed in a suit and tie and it seems like this is going to be some brother and sister talk. So we move on to the next photo and it's just of Kelly as she's talking to James. So that is it for this video guys, thank you guys so much for watching, hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully you're very excited for Supergirl to return and for us to get that trailer, that longer trailer that I keep on teasing sometime in the next week or so. So thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys later, goodbye. I see red.